What's Geechee, y'all? Shalom, brothers. Most of y'all know me as Eastside Inkwork or Inkwork. Y'all know me for slanging ink, doing tattoos. You know what I'm saying? I've done a lot of the tattoos I have. Now, a lot of people also know I'm now seeking the most high and showing myself approved. The scriptures inherently contradict tattooing. Leviticus chapter 19 verse 28 You shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead nor print marks upon you Now, yeah, I got face tattoos, you know what I'm saying? That's a direct That goes to show you the systemic issue the disconnect of culture our true culture is so-called blacks here in America We've been so influenced by other cultures. This tattooing is not in our culture. The scriptures strictly prohibit it. Yet I still do tattoos to this day. I did a tattoo yesterday. I don't want to continue to be doing tattoos. I will not be tattooing for the rest of my life. I'm working on transgressing up out of tattooing. I'm an artist. I can do many things. I'm not limited to tattooing and marking flesh. I would much rather be doing paintings. A lot of you have noticed that I've done a lot more paintings these days because I'm trying to transgress out of tattooing, out of sin, of wicked ways, wicked matters of wicked men. These are not our traditions, brothers. All these marks that we get and put on our bodies directly contradict the scriptures. I'm seeking the most high now, thus I'm working my way up I'm out of it. Right now, tattooing is my primary income. I can't just give it up. But what I'd like to do is put this message out there and encourage people to seek me for art-related things opposed to tattoo-related art, if that makes any sense. Now, I will be tattooing until the moment that I can stop. I want to be getting commissioned to do paintings, murals, artwork for people's homes, artwork for people's businesses, signs, banners. I can do a multitude of things. I'm not limited. I can do just about anything. Realism, cartoon, graffiti, urban art. It doesn't matter. I can do it all. I can paint. I can draw. I can work with all types of mediums and will continue to further my skill set in the arts. But I don't want to be tattooing forever. It goes directly against what I'm promoting, what I'm trying to get other brothers to awaken to. I'm not saying don't hit me up for tattoos because as long as I'm doing this, I'm going to do it because I have to make ends meet. I have to live in this society. I have to live in this society. We all do. But I have it in my mind. And in my, in my heart, my spirit, to get on up out of it. I do not want to tattoo forever. I don't want to be tattooing too much longer, to be honest. Literally an hour ago, within the hour, I was just approached about entering a shop. A tattoo shop and working out of a shop. Now that's a great opportunity in terms of this world. And, and, and allegedly being a... What is it? What is it? A uh, productive member of society, apparently. But it directly contradicts what I'm seeking, the path of righteousness that I have begun. So I'm not going to take that opportunity. You won't see me in a shop. I'm going to continue to work from home until I don't have to do tattooing, period. That's the conviction. That's the spirit within me. That I'm going to deny a financial opportunity to please the most high. That's conviction. I'm not I'm not making that or I'm not doing this and just saying that to 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 bring vanity to myself. I'm doing it to bring awareness to brothers and to show the true conviction and, and what it takes and what it entails, the sacrifices one must make to please the most high, if that's your intention. If it's not, so be it. 
I ain't here to tell you what to believe. I'm here to steer brothers that need direction, need guidance back to the path of the most high, back to our true culture. Because tattooing and and, and all the extra shit, the jewelries, running up the bag, all the extra shit, that ain't pleasing the most high. You don't care about that. You need to show yourself approved. The most high requires obedience and servitude. And all I am is a vessel for the most high, whether you like it or not. You don't got to agree with it. You choose to watch my content for, for who knows why. Just to disagree, you can show yourself out. Or you can continue to watch and, and, and try and find truth or try and find something to help you. I got game for just about everybody. I ain't saying I got all the game. I ain't saying I got all the answers. What I do have is a small amount of understanding, which I'm in continuously growing. And that's all that matters. With that said, hit me up for art. You know what I mean? Let me add some some aesthetics to your to your home. You know what I mean? I, I can do anything. I can do things that are that are tailored to females. I can do things that are tailored to males. It really doesn't matter. Art is art. And I have absolutely no limits, in my opinion, when it comes to art. So please hit me up. Help me get up on out of this transgressive ways that I'm doing in terms of tattoos. Again, I have the marks. I've been misled by this society. I've been led astray from the scriptures, from the most high. But I am now seeking the most high. And that is all I'm concerned about. I'm not concerned about the opinions of men. Women does not matter to me. I'm doing this to show myself approved. And in doing so, I must transgress out of my wicked ways at this moment. Hit me up for art, y'all. I'll get you right. As I was editing, I realized I want to touch on two things. I want to give a big shout out to my brother Judah Maccabeus. I sought counsel in my brother, and he led me back to the path of righteousness in terms of the tattoo shop opportunity that I was just presented with. And, and, and wise men seek counsel of other wise men, and that's what I did. I reached out to my brother, and he he put he put me back. He he didn't even tell me. He's never t told me to do anything, other than suggested scriptures, to read. But he's never told me to do any actions. He just speaks as a vessel for the Most High, and I've I've got nothing but knowledge and wisdom from my bro. Second, for you hotep niggas. I don't know if that's showing up very well, but that's a pyramid that says New Kemet. I was a pro-black motherfucker on that dumb shit not too long ago, about two years ago. I was on that, off that, tripping. There's, That's a false doctrine, brother. It's just, there's a lot, that, there's homosexuality entailed in that doctrine. There's a lot of things you brothers have not uncovered. Nor will you uncover. It's not for you. We're Israelites, brothers. We in the scriptures. Get off that whole type shit.